time to think. Can you name some animals on the basis of their sizes? Very big animals, big animals, small animals, very small animals. Habitat. Different animals live in different places. Elephant, lion, dog. Animals like elephant, lion, dog live on land. They are called terrestrial animals. Fish, octopus, squid. Animals like fish, octopus, squid live in water. They are called aquatic animals. Frog, crocodile, salamander. Frogs, crocodiles, salamanders live both on land and in water. They are called amphibians. Rat, snake, mole. Some animals dig holes in the ground and live in them. Rats, snakes, moles live underground in burrows. Nitty gritty animals that live on trees are called arboreal. Example birds, monkeys, squirrels. Varied shapes. Different animals have different body structures. Snakes and earthworms have long, slender bodies. Birds and fish have streamlined bodies. Frogs and toads have squat bodies. Jellyfish and octopus have parachute shaped body. The shape of the body of the animal enables it to live and move in its habitat. Snake, bird, fish, frog, jellyfish moving around. Animals move from one place to another in search of food and shelter. Different animals have different organs which help in their movements. Terrestrial animals walk and run with the help of four legs. Aquatic animals have fins and flippers to move in water. Some also have webbed feet. Insects have three pairs of legs to walk. Some insects like butterflies have wings to fly. Birds have wings to fly in the sky and two feet to hop and perch. Snakes and worms crawl on the ground. Take a break. Find out a flightless bird. Largest aquatic animal. Largest land animal. Tallest animal. Tails and animals. Many animals have tails. Some have long tails while others have small ones. They use them for different purposes. Monkeys hang from trees with their tails. They have long and strong tails. Fish use their tails to change direction in water. Kangaroos have small tails to balance their bodies while they are sitting on their hind legs and hopping. Dogs wag their tails to show their happiness. They curl their tails between their legs when they are scared. Cows and buffaloes use their tails to shoo away flies and birds that sit on them. Animals and their feeding habits On the basis of their feeding habits, animals can be divided into the following categories. Herbivores Herbivores feed on plants and plant products. Cows and goats eat grass. Sparrows eat grains. Squirrels eat nuts. Carnivores Carnivores feed on the flesh of other animals. Tigers and lions eat other animals. Snakes and lizards swallow their prey whole. Eagles eat small animals. Omnivores Animals like bear, crow, rats eat both plant products and flesh of animals. They are called omnivores. Scavengers Animals like vultures, raccoon, hyenas eat the flesh of dead animals. They are called scavengers. Nitty gritty. Cutting trees destroys the homes of many animals. They do have a right to live like us. Useful animals. Animals have been tamed by humans since early times. They are very useful to us. Cows and goats give us milk. Hens and ducks give us eggs. We get wool from sheep and yak. Skins of animals like snakes and crocodiles are used to obtain leather. 
honey bees make honey in the honeycombs donkeys and elephants carry loads horses and bullocks pull carts dogs guard our homes animals entertain us in the circus we must be kind to animals they attack us when they sense danger from us nitty gritty sick animals are taken to a veterinarian doctor for treatment